When Craftworld Iyandan found out that the maiden world of the Larsas had been destroyed by the expanding Tau Empire, they wanted retribution. They reduced a Sept colony to rubble, and the Tau were slow to respond, but in the wreckage of the colony they recovered several Wraithguard. The Earthcast scientists are fascinated with these, assuming that they are simply more advanced battlesuits. However, the young Tau race simply doesn't yet understand the secrets of the psychoconductive Wraithbone. Eventually, the Eldar return in force and recover the wreckage. However, the Tau are tenacious, so despite the superiority of Eldar technology, the Tau hold out for multiple weeks. The conflict only ends because both sides realize they have been manipulated the entire time by the Dark Eldar Archon and Ross Klax. The Tau Empire does extend the hand of friendship, hoping to gain the secrets of their technology. However, the Council of Eyandon simply ignores the primitive's offer and leaves to seek vengeance on Klax.